The FDA says Parmesan cheese, it may really just be cheddar cheese. It may be Swiss cheese, or it may be wood. <laughs> wood yeah. pulp. Wood pulp. I was, that's or, a left turn. Or it may be wood pulp. This is crazy, you guys. So there's a number of criminal cases, one especially against castle cheese. For the past 30 years, the FDA has found that castle cheese has been advertising that they have 100% Parmesan cheese, but in fact, it's there's, there's no Parmesan in it whatsoever. There's <laughs> other cheeses, and there's cellulose, which is... Paper. paper. It's the main ingredient uh. that paper is made out of. <laughs> um, yeah. And <laughs> this case right now, this is a criminal case that they're expecting the the president of the company, the president of Castle, to to plead guilty. The king, I assume. And this this would mean <laughs> this would mean that he would face up to a year in prison as well as face fines of $100,000. And then because this is now an issue, there's been some more digging because the FDA has said, like, if you're going to advertise that you have Parmesan cheese, 100% Parmesan cheese, and it's not 100% Parmesan cheese, you're going to face some criminal charges. So because of this, this test, all these tests have been conducted, here's some other cheeses, just in case you have these cheeses in your fridge. Oh, Essential, no. everyday 100% grated Parmesan cheese from Jewel Osco. 8.8% cellulose, cellulose, so that like paper, like wood chip product. Mm -hmm. Walmart Fiber. stores great value, 100% grated Parmesan cheese, 7, 8%. I know a lot of people use that. I've seen that in a lot I know. Of yeah. Yes. And, that one's yeah. huge. And then even Whole Foods, the 365 brand, where they didn't list cellulose as an ingredient. Oh. They have a little bit, 0.3, but still. And then Kraft, Kraft Parmesan cheese, which says in bold letters, like all the others, 100% Parmesan cheese, 3.8% cellulose that's almost what? four percent cellulose so do, were you shocked to hear that wood pulp and wood pulp cellulose is that the same thing yeah it's a dig indigestible cell wall material oh my gosh fiber i've been eating that Helps i you bought poop. all of those i love cheese and i've been oh, buying all yeah. those cheese brands you get the you get the 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 bin the little bin a little tub of, and spoon. you go like this and you just drop it in your mouth ah. yeah it's just uh, a snack. you're eating wood you're yeah. eating wood my first my first you know reaction to the title was like oh at least it's wood it's not like chemicals but i mean it's cellulose <laughs> I mean, it's still bad for you. Yeah. That ah. goes to show, like, how sad we, like, uh, as a, as the world, with all of our food, with, like, GMOs or with, with chemicals or wood, that, yeah, that you even had to compare it. Well, at least it's not chemicals. Right. Yeah. That's crazy. Yeah. So is the solution then to get, because I need to figure out how I'm going to solve this cheese thing for me. So, like, <laughs> just... is the solution you get a big block of cheese and you just grate it up yourself? Is that what they're saying to do? Because I need to know for tonight. And get organ organic. Organic. You need to know for immediately. <laughs> organic has a has a has a whole you know different slew of like guidelines that they have to pass. So, okay. I'm wondering... uh, but like, I, I you can have organic wood, I assume. Here's the thing: is I imagine there <laughs> needs to be some kind of amount of filler so it doesn't clump. That's all I'm thinking. Is like cellulose. Maybe something that's not bad for you, but I don't like when they're telling me it's 100% greater. That's like, the thing. That's what leads me to buy one over another. I think you, the answer is to get like a block of cheese. That's what I think too. But then I'm gonna have like one really beefy arm from how I'm grating so much cheese. Oh my god! Please do don't ever do that again, yeah, Brett. Do do cheese? Don't ever do that again. I think a lot of it to do is is to do with the brand. I mean, if it's if it's the craft brand, I mean they are going to put fillers and things like that because I'm sure they do with their other cheeses. Mm -hmm. yeah. So I think getting you know like natural and organic, maybe from you know like a Whole Foods or something that. You know, is, is trusted and not in the big plastic packages and from the cow directly. From the, is yeah. what I'm hearing. <laughs> I yes. think they from need the cow yeah. <laughs> just lay underneath the cow, make with cheese, milk it, hold it in your mouth till it becomes cheese. Yeah, swallow. Is that how it works? What's your That's ew? How is What's that your... how you make cheese? <laughs> yeah, I was like, oh, that's how I've experienced cheese before. Mozzarella, you just boil milk and scoop the top, add enzymes and salt. Really? What enzymes? Can you get them? At I don't the know. Store? You get them in a little packet. It looks like. A, Have you done that before? Yeah, you can. We'll do it. We should do it. We should totally do I'm it. Totally it didn't really with work. You, mm. What's but. your guys' favorite cheese? You first. Ooh, I'd have to go with goat cheese. Mm. Yeah, good call. Mm -hmm. Too well, late. Nope, you don't get a yeah. cheese. <laughs> she bought. Well, I'll begin. I would say I would begin with a nice gear gear one. I'm love... from the area where they say Gu that. Do you want me to yeah, like, yeah. Yeah. like I don't know. Yes. And then I think also I love blue cheese, provolone, Swiss is nice. Um, a sharp cheddar. 
off the block. She's from Europe. Okay, this they, isn't this Grace's is like, is like review this is of the cheese short, show. No, this is the short right? answer You're for a European. It's for not European, the this is like a tiny. Cheese show. That's where cheese comes from. <laughs> this isn't Grace's, Grace's review of cheese show. Grace's review of cheese show. What's your favorite That's color? All I'm I like doing a when I get purple. home, I'm making I like that show. Red, green, uh, black, brown, white. What are you talking feta. about? This is no, her but, answer for no, everything. But I mean What's feta. your favorite movie? Uh, well, just all the ones that have come out. <laughs> oh my god. That's <laughs> what she did. What's she listed favorite? every freaking cheese. She, I know. What's your favorite cheese, Brett? Uh, an aged Gouda. The, oh, the, the, oh, with Gouda. the little, uh, see? I was right. Oh, I with like the Gouda. little crystals in it, because it's been aged, and you're eating it, and you're like, mm -hmm. there's a little pop. Like, What's that? <laughs> What's yours? I, I like cashew cheese and like Daya, like I do. I have when no I idea to... what your what words you just she said. said. They're not cheese. We asked her vegan cheese. Like, vegan What's cheese. Your They're vegan cheeses. Oh, yeah. But when I used to eat cheese, uh, What's your favorite cheese? I used to no. love smoked cheese. He was like, what's your love favorite cheese? Peanuts. I love cashew oh, cheese. Oh, I hate, I hate, I don't like I smoked. I love smoked cheese on a cracker. Smoked cheese. smoked cheese on a cracker with some sardines and well, mustard. Smoked cheese sardines? on a cracker sounds like Disgusting. something people in the Midwest say so they don't have to take the Lord's name in vain. <laughs> smoked cheese on a cracker. <laughs> And then wave your finger. Smoke cheese on a cracker. Mm -mm. Okay. <laughs> I can't. Okay. All right. Big round of applause for our guest yeah. today. So good. Gavin McIntosh. You guys, American nice. Fable coming out soon. March 13th is premiering at South by Southwest. And then also you guys can check them out on the Fosters. Thank you so much for joining us. Yeah, thank you guys. All right. We'll see you guys next time on Pop Trigger.